Motopiola Abiola born March 1982, is a British non-practicing barrister, entrepreneur and businesswoman. She is the founder and CEO of Intern Avenue, an online internship website designed to connect employers with students and graduates. Dupsey appeared on the Thomson Reuters Power List named as one of the most influential black businesswomen in Great Britain in 2013. She has been featured in the press and on television relating to recruitment, business, and entrepreneurial pursuits. She pitched on Series 10 of BBC television show Dragon's Den, attracting an investment offer from business tycoon, Peter Jones. Early life Born in London, England, Dupsey Abiola is the daughter of Chief MKO Abiola and Dele Abiola. Her father was a famous and successful Nigerian business tycoon and philanthropist. Dupsey grew up with her mother and five siblings in North London. She has paternal half-siblings with whom she has limited contact. At age nine, Dupsey independently set up a business producing and selling puzzle magazines with a friend at school making a tidy profit. MKO Abiola was a strong influence on her interest in business. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Family life. Dupsey's father, MKO Abiola, became an active campaigner for civil rights and democracy and won the first free democratic presidential election in Nigeria in June 1993. Following the result, the military regime refused to relinquish power and declared an annulment. MKO was later placed under indefinite detention and was denied contact with the outside world including his, family. his incarceration sparked national and international outrage. Many supporters including former UN Secretary and Nobel Prize winner, Kofi Annan, attempted to secure MKO Abiola's release. There were widespread protests and high-profile political assassinations, including key civil rights campaigners and members of the Abiola family. MKO Abiola died very suddenly on the day of his intended release on 7 July 1998 when Dupsey was 16. The circumstances surrounding the death of her father remain an incredibly difficult and emotional subject for her. Education Despite a troubled upbringing, Dupsey was a gifted student who received academic prizes and awards including a Frederica Lord bursary and an International English Speaking Union scholarship. Dupsey attended South Hampstead High School for secondary school and then went on to read law at Oxford University New College. She was an elected JCR committee member, and an active public speaker, and legal debater. In 2004, Dupsey was notably singled out by fashion designer, Tom Ford, during an event at the Oxford Union who interrupted his speech to praise her beauty and dress sense. Career <laughs> <laughs> Legal career After university, Dupsey was awarded a Lord Denning Scholarship and East Ham Scholarship by the Honourable Society of Lincoln's Inn and began her career at the bar. She attended Inns of Court School of Law and was called to bar in 2006. Dupsey moved into private practice as an employed barrister after completed pupillage at 22 old buildings. She worked on a number of complex and high-profile cases, including involvement in the Wembley litigation. <laughs> Intern Avenue Dupsey left her career as a lawyer to create Intern Avenue in late 2010 which is her first large-scale entrepreneurial project. Intern Avenue publicly launched in autumn 2012. Intern Avenue was developed in London which has begun to develop a blossoming technology scene. 
The site has been well received and featured by the national press and technology press included Wired. In November 2018, Abiola was named to the Financial Times list of the top 100 minority ethnic leaders in technology. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Television and reception. Dupsey appeared on Channel 4 in February 2012 discussing entrepreneurship with Business Minister, Mark Prisk MP. On 7 October 2012, Dupsey pitched her business on Episode 5, Series 10 of BBC Dragon's Den and appeared in extended BBC footage on the "...psychology of a successful pitch". She was offered backing by business tycoons, Peter Jones and Hilary Devey. Intern Avenue became the first recruitment business to successfully pitch on Dragon's Den since its inception in 2004. Peter Jones described her as a real entrepreneur in the making, and that her pitch was superb. 